For many players with NBA dreams, the G League is a stepping stone to achieving that dream. In Delaware, some current Sixers rose up in the ranks to become fan favorites. Sports director Don Bell here with more on a fresh start in the first state. Always some good stories coming out of there. Nice. Yeah, you know. Yeah. All right, so Mac Attack, Big Mac, Return of the Mac. Let's flash back to the NBA Slam Dunk Contest in February. It was won by a dude no one had ever heard of. It was Mac McClung, a 6'2 undrafted guard out of Texas Tech. He scratched and clawed his way onto the Sixers roster by way of the Delaware Bluecoats. Now, we can't wait to see what they have brewing in Wilmington. Alicia Roberts has more on a fresh start to a new season. The Delaware Bluecoats are getting set for their 11th season, and they say this year will be better than ever. Good. The Delaware Bluecoats are back and ready to defend their championship title. This was our third year making it to the finals, and third year's the charm. The minor league affiliate of the 76ers calls Wilmington home and has been a platform for players pursuing their NBA dreams, says team president Larry Neely. You think about Jaden Springer, uh, B Ball Paul. Um, those are guys that started here with the Blue Coats and now have been promoted and moved up, um, realized their dream of playing in the NBA and now are contributors to the 76ers. And that's really what it's about. Milai says one of the best parts of the G League is bringing the love of the game to a fan base who otherwise might not get to see live hoops with promotions for kids and up close player action. We have this length of the court kid zone with inflatables. We have our mascot out there. A lot of access to our players before and after the game. Uh, it's very economical. Like you're coming to a game, our average ticket price is $15. Blue Coats basketball is also about giving back. The team did more than 150 appearances this offseason. They can get into the fabric of the community and make a difference in these small cities. Um, using our players and the power of basketball to do that. As for what's next, Milai says carrying on the tradition of Philly sports at its best is always top of mind. I, mean, I think the Sixers brand is so iconic, and it's especially in this region. And uh, the beauty is that we get to add a banner next to that with our G League championship banner. The Blue Coats open their season Friday night against the Westchester Knicks. Tip off is 7 p.m. Alicia Roberts, CBS News, Philadelphia. Alicia, thank you. You can catch the Blue Coat season opener tomorrow on our sister station, Philly 57. The team mascot, by the way, will be joining us live in studio tomorrow morning at 9.